Hello, and welcome back to the Vintage Toy Review. And today we're going over the Star Wars Black Series, Anakin Skywalker from Attack of the Clones. There you can see in the older packaging, image of Anakin in the back. Kind of a cocky image. And there's a figure on the front. And so there's the image of the young Wynakin. I call him Wynakin, because this is the movie he whined the most in. There's a figure, which I like Anakin, don't get me wrong. We got Star Wars there, the Black Series. Number 110, Anakin Skywalker, Padawan, Anakin. Gibberish, nothing, and the image again with the right above Anakin. Now, well, let's get this guy out, let's see what we got. And here he is, this fella out of the packaging. Let's do a nice little spin so you get the figure out of the packaging. Very nice. Now, for accessories, he comes with his lightsaber. Which this one is a little different on the hilt, a little bent there. Let me try to straighten that. There we go, a little better. But the hilt is a little different. Because this is the one before it got cut in half. I'm going to pull the blade out like so. And we'll just stick to it belt here. Do we have a... There's a spot there, but... Oh, well. Let's pop it back in. There we go. Now, you can see the figure close up. Nice head sculpt there for the young Hayden Christensen as Anakin. Nice sculpt on the body there. You can see the edges, very nice. Nice tunic. Boots, very nice sculpting on the boots and paint, paint apps. I really like this figure. Little ponytail, the Jedi ponytail and Jedi braid. Up, articulation, head goes all around, goes down so far, up so far, a little bit of a head tilt, not much, arms go so far, let's spin all the way around, elbows bend and swivel at the elbows, and twist at the direction. Now we got torso, not much, but a little bit on the back. This thing like the ground. Legs go so far, so far. Upper thigh, double joint knee. And ankle. Get him to hold his lightsaber hand. And there we go. And again, ready to go. Slaughter some sand people. I do wish he came with a rope, though. They need to bring more ropes for the Jedi. And here we go. And again, with the other release from Revenge of the Sith. Differences here, because there are some minor differences between these two besides the head sculpts. Uh, both have great head sculpts. Upper bodies are pretty much the same, those are the same. This one has a little cloth there, while this one doesn't. The boots are the same, just a little bit of different coloring. 
results are a little bit different, yeah? You can see. There. And there. That one has a pouch there. Pouches are different from on the back. Alright, so they did actually go and do the detail and change some stuff up and not reuse everything. Oh yeah, the head sculpt there. Yeah, let's get a closer look, shall we? Very nice. There we go. Stand. And you can see the lights of the hilts are completely different. Uh, the Attack of the Clones versus Revenge of the Sith. in here. Well, it's a good one. Doesn't have anything to stick there. But it does have a hole. Oh, it does have a hole. So it doesn't work. And here we go with Anakin and Obi-Wan going up against Count Dooku. Three great figures right here. I'm so glad the Black Series started doing clone figures, our biggest from the prequels. I just wish we got more of those plates, which is like Dooku has. Thank you.